Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a gym gym wear haul from Alphalete. For my regular YouTube friends, you guys always ask me where I get all of my gym wear. They're literally all from Alphalete. I've been affiliated with Alphalete for a little over a year now. This is where I get all of my hot girl gym wear. If you're not familiar with Alpha Elite sales, we only have two sales per year, Black Friday and their birthday sale. Their birthday sale is going to be way bigger than the Black Friday sale. Everything on the website will be up to 70% off. All of the new items, which are the items that you guys will be seeing today, will be 10% off. All of my girlies, you guys keep asking, the Amplify shorts and the Amplify leggings are never in stock. That's because they're usually sold out in common sizes within the first 30 minutes to the first hour of the launch okay the launch is happening on this saturday at 12 p.m central time so you need to set your alarm sisters if you want the amplify shorts which i guarantee they're going to be sell out in common sizes within 30 minutes for this launch i do have a code which is my name it's mukta i've given you guys discount codes and stuff but i never get anything off of you guys using those codes they're legit just discount codes but with alphalete this is the only brand that i'm currently working with that i actually get like a small small percentage and i am trying to save up for a new camera because you guys deserve that 4k hd videos and some of you may be confused that it's like, oh, I put in your code, but I didn't get any discounts. It's not a discount code, it's just a support code. And everything on the website will be on sale already. The sale is going to last for 72 hours and that's it. You do not want to miss it. Literally, we only have two big sales every single year. My sizing, I am between a small and a medium. So depending on the styles and the type of clothes that I'll be showing you guys, I'll tell you guys which size I am, which size I prefer. For my stats, so you guys can compare, I am 5'6", 150 pounds, measurements 32C, waist 25 inches or 26 inches. I haven't measured myself in a long time. Glutes are 39 inches and then thighs. I do have a lot of thighs and legs. They are 24 inches. But before we get started with this gym wear haul, this video is made possible by Kara. So what is Kara? Kara is a monthly subscription website that ships out your supplements based on your goals. You take a personalized short quiz about your main concerns. My personal concerns are my hair, skin, and gut health. So they sent me some probiotics, which I already take every day, collagen, keratin, and a couple more supplements. Not only that, but their packaging is so cute. Since these supplements are specific to you, they put your name in these cute little packaging. What I love about Care Of is that it's personalized, specific to you, not to anybody else because we're all different. We have different goals when it comes to our health. Thank you, Kara, for sponsoring this video. More information will be linked in the description box and you can use my code, which is my name, Mukda at checkout to get 50% off your order and you can get supplements delivered right to your door. <gasps> you thought this video was gonna be sponsored by Alpha Elite, huh? No, it's not. None of my Alpha Elite hauls are ever sponsored. All opinions are going to be my own. If I don't like something, I'm gonna say it. If I don't recommend something, I'm also gonna say it. Everything that you need to know for the Amplify launch. All of the bright colors are not 100% squat proof, nor are they 100% sweat proof, but you can get away with it wearing nude underwear. And the same goes with the halo leggings that I will be showing you guys, nude undies only. I have worn these crop tops to the gym and my pit stains showed through and that's okay. I actually don't mind. I am wearing the color bloom. These shorts tend to roll up all shorts roll up on me, but they're not as bad when you size up. So that's why I recommend sizing up. I can still fit in a small. It fits basically the same, it's just there's just more room when you size up. So it's not gonna be like a huge major difference, just slightly minor differences between a size small and a size medium for me. Long sleeve, amplify crop top. They're also very thin, breathable. Shorts have the side paneling detail that you can barely see, but these side panels are much more delicate. So be careful, especially when you're trying to 
yank them up. I know we all try to make our butt look bigger by like hiking them up. Don't do this when you're trying to hike it up your butt crack. I always just kind of like start from the bottom, wiggle your way up, and then kind of pull it because you're going to ruin the booty scrunch area if you hike it up because that can cause some ripping and I've done that in the past before. The Amplify collection is the number one collection that you need to get your hands on if you're like, okay, move down, like what do I buy? I don't want to spend that much money. Let's say you only want to spend like under $100. I would either get a pair of Amplify leggings or a pair of Amplify shorts. The Amplify long sleeve crop top, it has the Alpha Elite logo in the front, super cute. The two bras that are going to be launching are the Revivals bra, which is this one. They're just plain in the front, and then in the back, it has some crisscross detailing with the Alpha Elite logo sewed in the back. This one, I would say it's medium support, true to size. And then this bra is called the Impact Bra. This one is medium to high support. This bra would be better for girls that are bigger chested. It's just your basic razor back bra, Alpha Elite logo sewed in the back. And it has this detailing in the back, also in the front, and a little bit between your chest bras equally like i don't like one more than the other they're both super cute and you can't go wrong with them this color okay i am obsessed with every single color okay here's the green The inseam of the shorts are 3.5 inches, but if you like want a more conservative length, I'd recommend sizing up. But if you like your shorts to be like super duper shorts and tight fitting, then stay true to size. This color blue. These shorts are actually a size small. They fit like basically the same. They're just more compressive and tight. And yeah, and they definitely roll up more like when you squat. So that's why I recommend sizing up in the shorts. Next up are the halo leggings. I have them in all of the bright colors and also black. 100% size up in the halo leggings. I got them all in a size medium. I've tried a size small before. I got a size small like on, but I definitely can't squat or bend over in them or else I'll rip them. None of these bright colors are 100% squat proof just letting you know and they are not 100% sweat proof i wasn't sure how i was going to like the black halo leggings because usually i size up in black just because black yarn and alpha Elite tends to be tighter than all of the other colors but i actually really like the fit of the black halo leggings compared to the other colors and these are the most squat proof out of all the other colors Something that I want to know is when you're like pulling your leggings up, especially on the side panels on the side and the back for the halo leggings is to be very careful because you will most likely rip them. So what I like to do is like start at the bottom, like from my calves and just kind of scrunch it up. Bloom. So, well, wanted to show you guys what the color charcoal looks like in the Revivals bra. 
this is what the color charcoal looks like it's more of like a gr gray green I quickly wanted to go over um, the difference between the old halo leggings versus the new halo leggings. So the old ones here, it has front seam running down. And then for the new ones, there is no front seam at all. Also, the Soden Alphalete logo in the back is also different. Here's the old logo. Front seam, new leggings, no front seam different Alphalete logo. For the new halos, the contouring are slightly lower because in the old pair, the contouring comes up pretty high. Old leggings, the contouring basically sits on your butt and then for the new pair, the contouring sits below your butt, like it's supposed to go below your butt cheeks. And then waistbands are the same and they are the same length. These Infinity Studio joggers, they are very, very lightweight. They're mostly polyester, which means that they're thin. Just think of like a windbreaker material. That's what these joggers are. Stay true to size. I size up to a size medium and it fits kind of weird. I think I would like it a lot better if it was a size small. It won't keep you warm. So I would wear like leggings underneath this and wear this over if you live in like a cold climate. The feeling of these joggers are cool to the touch. I don't know, I think a medium just looks weird on me and I feel like there's so much room in the crotch area. The pockets is kind of weird. The pockets are more like up here. Okay, it has a string for you to tighten your waist. Zip up pocket, only on one side though. And then the Alphalete logo on the other side. Okay, next is the Trace jacket. We're only coming out with two colors. I am wearing the Trace jacket in gray love this jacket it's super cute i love crop jackets over like regular jackets and hoodies there is no thumb hole it has a zip up true to size you can zip it up all the way i feel suffocated when i do that <laughs> or it's just like partially next i have the trace joggers i think i got them in a size small and also a size medium just so you guys could see what they fit like on me here is the trace joggers in a size small and they fit like leggings it's made out of 90 percent nylon so it's thin so it's not like thick cotton it's more thin breathable material and it has an adjustable string in the front but it's on the inside so you can hide it once you tie it like this it has a seam in the front which i'm not a fan of because there could be a slight camel toe situation going on i much prefer like pockets like regular traditional pockets like these instead of like pockets that goes like in the front i feel like that's not very like practical um alphalete silicone logo on the side then we have Persian blue. Actually, really, really love this color. This is Purple Dove. Another thing is it's kind of hard to get it over your ankles. So just keep that in mind. Definitely recommend sizing up. But this is Purple Dove. These joggers are meant to be like slim fitting because this is a size medium and I feel like there's not much of a difference when it comes to like how I look, but there's definitely way more room in a size medium. I can get it over my ankles and my calves much better. For the waist, even in a size medium, it still fits like a small. There's just more room, less compression, more comfortable overall. So I much prefer a size medium. Next is the Windbreaker in black merle you have alpha logo on the side with both arms and on the side it's not completely black it's more gray two zip up front pockets alpha silicone logo also on the chest try it on i got a size medium in these jackets and i 100 percent recommend sizing up because the small is just way too small for me and i like my hoodies and windbreakers to be a little bit oversized and baggier there's so much more room and it's just much more comfortable next this is the jade trace skort there's shorts underneath i love this 
so much. I think this would be like the perfect thing to wear when you're like running errands and going grocery shopping like during the summertime because you don't have to worry about like your skirt being too short or you're showing too much because because there are shorts underneath the skirt and I also have the skirt in gray. Gray is more like brown, like dark brown. Okay, here is the tray skirt in gray and I am wearing the Evo twist crop top, so in a size small. True to size, but there's definitely a lot of room. So you could size down in this crop top if you want to. Basically, it's like your regular t-shirt, except there's like a little twist in the front. In the back, it's plain. I really like this raised Alphalete logo, sort of like a tag, but it's very high quality. So now that I'm trying more of this crop top on, I would definitely say size down because there's just a lot of room, a lot of fabric. I think it would be a lot cuter if it was tight fitted. So definitely size down in these. And there's also a seam running in the front. I think it would be cuter if it was like this, you know? Here is the crop top in white. These are the regular Evo crop tops and these are the Evo crop tops with a twist in the front. So with the regular crop top, the length is I mean, it's slightly cropped, but it's still like conservative. It's your basic t-shirt. The Alphalete logo is now on the side of your arm. In the back, it has like these detailings. And then in the front, it's just plain. So I got gray, blue, and purple, which is like a light lilac color. Okay, for the regular crop top, I would definitely say true to size. Don't size down just because it's a little tight up here. It's scoop neck, plain in the front. And then on the side, it has like this little dip. And even though it's like a crop top, it's more like a regular t-shirt. Alphalete logo on the side. Stone gray. The material is lightweight, breathable. Next is the Evo long sleeve crop top. Out of all the three styles of these t-shirts, I much prefer the long sleeve. I don't know, I'm just a long sleeve kind of gal, you know? Crop long sleeve, you can't go wrong with it. I'm wearing the color stone gray. Fitted long sleeve scoop neck. So the front goes like across your belly and then in the back it's slightly scooped which I actually really like. Same Alphalete logo in the back. That is it for my haul. <sighs> I tried on a lot of clothes. In conclusion, my number one favorite thing from Alphalete is anything from the Amplify collection, whether it would be like a pair of leggings or a pair of shorts. And you can use my code at checkout if you want to. I would really appreciate it. You don't have to. Okay, but if you want to support me, you can. It's free to use. And that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!